Hi, I'm, I'm Rick Russo. I'm president and CEO of Applied Spectra. I've been a scientist at uh, Berkeley National Lab since 1982. I came here to do a, a laser spectroscopy. And this was the, the directive of the lab that Dr. Rick Russo was leading, is that he was looking at laser ablation to do chemical analysis. So when I was doing the fundamental research, I quickly realized how effective this method or laser ablation is in doing a very elegant, fast, and you know, a chemical analysis that does not really generate any chemical waste. So when I came back to join his lab again as a visiting scientist, I immediately thought about a lot of application where this technology can be quite useful. And, and fortuitively, uh, Dr. Russo decided to start the company, asked me to join the company. So here we go, so we started the company. This company is basically founded on the research effort that you know, Dr. Uh, Rick Russo led over his uh, almost 30 years of research experience at Lawrence Berkeley National Lab. After five years later, we, we're very grateful that we actually developed this technology further enough to have these uh, commercial instruments that we are actively um, selling to commercial markets and proving values to customers and showing basically laser ablation can be a quite effective method in doing the chemical analysis. We're at the heart of Silicon Valley where all the laser companies are, solar companies, materials companies, and these are potential uh, customers and markets. And we feel that it's very important to closely work with the customer. So by just being the fact, uh, taking advantage of the location here, we're such a, we're, we have a pool of great, uh, you know, intelligent people. We have a location that has highly qualified students here at Berkeley, Stanford, and there are other really nice, uh, uh, the highly prestigious school right here in this location. And there are a pool of customers that are ready that we have identified the needs uh, for this type of uh, uh, analytical tools. It's a disrupt disruptive technology in that it's actually changing how chemical analysis is done. Um, so I think uh, by really maturing our technology, uh, we have a vision of really changing the paradigm, traditional paradigm of how chemical analysis is done.